guys. <laughs> so I know I've been, I've been MIA, but surprise, surprise, I'm in Mexico. Like, what the heck am I doing in Mexico, you might ask. <laughs> what am I doing here? Um, this is actually the first stop of a three month tour, which I promise I'll be taking you guys along with, but I have to show you guys my room. I have to, like you guys are gonna, because I did. <laughs> By the way, I'm actually very, very sick. Um, but I'm actually getting better, which is great. But yeah, I've literally had tonsillitis. I've had, I've been so congested last week or so. Um, so getting here on a 21 hour flight, all the way from Australia was hell. All the pressure in the plane, being congested, I would not recommend. If you're traveling, please be um, good of health before you do that because I was so sick. Everyone thought I had COVID and I did not have COVID. And my voice was like, I was like this. Oh, my name is Ajiro and I'm from um, Ireland and that's my passport. I'm, I'm trying to get into your country. Please let me come in. I literally couldn't speak and I've only been able to just be, speak right now. And I'm still, I probably shouldn't be talking this much, probably, but who cares? <laughs> so who wants a tour? Yeah, you want a tour? Yeah, let's go, let's go. Baby girl, you're so fine. I can't get you off my mind, ooh girl. So guys, this is our beautiful living room. It's massive, by the way. Just for like clarity, the door is all the way down there. Like it's huge. Like this could probably fit like four of my living rooms back home. Like, oh, the marble table. Are you serious? There's a marble table in here, guys. What are we gonna do with a marble table? That's me. Um, we've got a mini bar that is literally gonna be stocked all the time because we pay for all inclusive. Oh, just in case anyone was like wondering why I'm here alone. Um, I'm not here alone, by the way. <laughs> but because I flew all the way from Australia, I had to fly a day in advance. So I flew like the morning of the 25th and 21 hours later, I arrived the morning of the 25th in Mexico. So I flew back in time, which is so weird. But the girls I'm coming that are gonna be here with me, they should be landing soon. And they're gonna gag when they see this room because I didn't tell them we got this room. I don't know how they're gonna cope. Okay, back to the tour. So we've got two big bedrooms. This is one of them. Me and one girl will be staying here. We've got three TVs, by the way. Just, you know, casual for Saturday. Just three TVs. Why not? Another beautiful couch. Massive bed. Don't get me started on the bathroom. You guys are going to gag when you see the bathroom. <sighs> okay. That's my his and her sink all the way down there. What the heck? We've got a beautiful tub in the middle, as you do. A shower fit enough for 10 people. 10 people could literally sit, sit in that shower easy. Easy, it's like a steam room. Why do I have three shower heads? I literally, I literally saw it like, I'm never leaving. I am never leaving! <laughs> like what is this life? This isn't real life guys. This is not real life. Like, you know, I know I work hard and everything, but I just don't feel like I deserve this. Like, what the heck? No, I do deserve this. I do. <laughs> but my favorite part has got to be our balcony. First of all, look how big the balcony is. Got a jacuzzi all the way over there. And the view takes my breath away each time and I've only been here 40 minutes Psst. private session beach private pool guys I am eagerly awaiting the girls they should be on their way here I wonder if I should just go and get them 
Do I even know the way? So the girlies are here. Say hi. hi. This is Sonia, Julianne, and Esther. Okay, so this is their joining room. They have their own jacuzzi. Isn't that sick? Do, do, do. And and then, what do you want to say to the vlog, guys? What do you think? What do you think? Soft light. <laughs> it's really it's giving. Right. It's giving. Right. Lack of luxury and all that. Have money, guys. Yeah. Have money. Have money. <laughs> so, guys, this is day two in Mexico officially. And we are on our way to a beautiful yacht party. It's called a hip hop boat party. Say hi, girls. Hi. <laughs> okay. Um, we're a bit late this morning, but hopefully we get there on time and we can just party the whole day, basically. It's actually like an all-inclusive type thing. So we get free drinks, free food, and unlimited. And it's art about music too. So it's gonna be good, it's gonna be good. All right, keep you updated. Guys, we're actually going on a hip hop party today. Oh my god, we're about to go. 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 Siete copas, una juca tequila Sali, 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 perrear No tienes vergüenza, mami Baby, quiero ser el río de tu Tokio Chingamos en la casa de papel sin negocio Esta vida nunca se acaba la fiesta Comiéndote todo el día que se joda esa dieta Hasta ahora soco, 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 soco Yo no le quiero a tu fucking Guys, so this is the aftermath of the boat party. Uh, me and Sonia had champagne shows. <laughs> It was so fun. We're so well. I don't regret it. But well, Esther and Julianne didn't get in on the fun. I run away. Boring. <laughs> but yeah, it was so hip hop. Fun. Hip hop boat party. Cat I would coon. recommend. Ten out of ten. Highly recommend. Ten out of ten. Do it. Hello guys, we are clearly back from the hip hop boat party. Yes. Um, we we're still alive. We're alive. We're still Barely. alive. <laughs> No, we are trying. <laughs> this is the first day. Come on. I know my voice is going. Look, we're trying it. Anyway, back to what I was saying is that we survived and now we're going out for round two. Yeah. Um, where are we going? We're going to have dinner first and yeah. then we're going to go meet up with some and people. What Thai? Some Asian fusion yeah. thing? Yeah. But this is only really day one of Cancun. Or oh, day two for me. Yes. Okay, cool. <laughs> Tell us what we're doing today. Explore pie. Explore pie. And what, what's that entail? What activities? Um, zip lining. Yeah. Activities. Um, some more. Um, some more. <laughs> <laughs> not doing. Elaborate. I might yeah. do because I'm actually the one that was organized and brought my bikini. Out. What? Oh, okay. They didn't bring your bikini. It's not about the bikini. It's about the bikini. All right. Um, so yeah, we're gonna do some activities today, some zip lining, some water rafting, some ADVs, and we'll take you with us. I love the way my camera has like night filter, so even though it's dark now, my camera's bright. Love that for us. 
guys please don't hate me but honestly i've been having so much fun getting over my illness um living my best life for me to even remember to be as active as i should be with the camera please don't hate me but today is actually day four in cancun and we had a bit of a chill day because it was a bit of a messy day yesterday at that ziplore park with all the supply the atv riding and all that nonsense but Today we had a chill day, you know, it was a chill day. We rested, you know. I recovered from my malaria, it was all good. So tonight we're just getting ready because we're gonna have some dinner and then we're gonna go out for um, a night out, you know. We're going to Coco Bongo's tonight. It's been highly recommended um, and I'm sure that we'll love it. But I will take my camera with me because what the heck have I been doing? Like, it's, it's not good, it's not on, it's not on. But yeah. Also, by the way, I love Cancun. Love Cancun! It's so fun! It's so fun! I literally love it. But we actually leave in a few days. So we're going to Tulum, baby! Tulum! And that's even going to be more fun because we're in the villa there. Tulum has lots of beach clubs. It's going to be lit. So stay tuned. What do you guys think of the holiday so far? Of Cancun. Yeah. So far. Of being with your besties. Oh my god, I am in love with this place. Like I am yeah. honestly tomorrow is our last full day. People. In Cancun, I know. In this resort. In, in res this resort, mm. so but it's fine. It's we're okay. gonna make the most of it and it's we're okay. going to even a better place in Tulum. So inshallah. <laughs> in the name of Jesus. <laughs> Welcome to day five of our holiday. Um, we are currently on our way to downtown Cancun. Um, anyway, guys, come into the shot. Say hi, hi to the vlog. Hi. Look how cute everyone looks. Come on, Sonia, get in the shot. Hella cute. This is us every day. Guys, I have to give you a story time of last night. Best night of my life. Like, and my future husband and everything. Yeah. <laughs> But keep you up to date. So we're going to downtown Can Cancun tonight, to this evening. Um, it's currently 5.30. We only got home at 5.30 a.m. So it took us a whole day to get, you know, revitalized. But we made it. Um, so we're going to go to downtown Cancun, see some of the sites, see some of the market, see what we can buy as we do. And I'll get back to you. Thank you. Just four black girls in Mexico, breaking stereotypes, living our best lives, and getting the bag. Amen. And we just need to appreciate what, like we just need to appreciate, 
these pictures of Madeline and also we need to appreciate what life has given us because this is just paradise guys and you have to experience it Definitely. you have to come to Haven Riviera mm -hmm. in Cancun all inclusive stay in the master suite mm -hmm. like just live your best life go yep. to go to six restaurants a night have four pools why not do you know what I mean just chill have a nightclub in your restaurant in your hotel like what the <laughs> fuck like why not do you why know what I mean not? why not like just live your best life guys that's all I can say live your best and get a Tesla I love Teslas so guys, I know I haven't been the best with the vlogging, but we left Cancun. <laughs> we're in Tulum now, we're in Tulum. It's our first night in Tulum, we're going out. We're in Orange, how cute. We're going out, just have some dinner. Um, but I've been really bad with this vlogging stuff, don't, kill it. don't hate me, but I can give you a quick tour if you want. Just with the downstairs, I'm not going back upstairs, I'm not bothered, um, but yeah. So it's, a, it's an Airbnb this time. It's a cute loft style. Um, I think those stairs are so cute. It goes up, there's two bedrooms upstairs, two bathrooms. This is our kitchen. Yeah, it's quite big. We've got a private pool out there, of course. Can't really see it in my reflection. Oh, maybe you can. So, got a private pool up there. I just love the aesthetic of Tulum. It's very, um. It's given very much tropical, do you know what I mean? So I love this aesthetic. I think it's gonna be a good part of the trip. So I'm very excited for it. Um, but yeah, I will try and keep you updated. Obviously that's not what I do, but I will tonight. Look at the girlies. Look at the men. You say hi guys. Ooh, guys, this light is giving. Juliet looks really good for some reason. Thank you. Oh, we got Miss Icy over here. Show them the chain. Show them the chain. Show them the chain. <laughs> so guys, we're here in Casa Banana in Tulum. Um, yeah, so it's such a vibe. We're gonna have dinner now. Um, but yeah, I'm really happy to be here. It's a nice temperature too. It's not too, not too hot, not too bad. But yeah, Julian, get the view. Get So guys, we're here in Tulum. Tulum. We're gonna have a nice day today. Mm -hmm. We're going for some breakfast. Yep. And then what are we doing next day? We're gonna do some shopping, get some food, some alcohol in the house, and then what is worth? Yeah. What is worth? Or what is worth before the show? And then tonight, where are we going tonight? <laughs> we're going to the Black House party. Yay. That's gonna be <laughs> lit. But I promise I will show you Tulum today because I'm, I'm actually the shittest person ever with this vlog stuff. So. She's having too much fun, that's why. That's yeah. why she's forgetting to vlog. Yeah. <laughs> so this is where we're staying. We're staying right over there in these villas. I will link it down for you. It's very cute. Guys, not gonna lie, Tulum is still in development stage. So a lot of the parts look like Africa. Um, but I like it. It's very rustic, you know? This is raw, this is raw, raw material. There's a lot of construction going on also. Um, which is good. Oh, I'll be to Mientras celebrando en tu cuarto, sabe agridulce como el impacto. Baby, it's a party. Put your drinks up. Two shots to the heart, now I'm fucked up, so we'll do it your way. No, I go put it because I'm faded. No, I go put it, la culpa en tu Guys, so we're here in Pajes, we just have some breakfast. Um, it's actually a really cool vibe, we're in like a tree house type stuff. So we're here on the beach in Tulum, loving life. There we clearly have the beach. 
got some beaches behind. I really love the aesthetic of Tulum. It feels very much like jungle, like, you know, all the tropical leaves and the wooden slats. So, very, very happy. <laughs> So what do you rate? Oh. <laughs> what do you rate Tulum so far? So far, I will say, well, we've only been here not even a day. Two days. Two days? <laughs> well, this day too, kind of. Well, not really. Okay. <laughs> Maybe a day. Let's okay. say a day. Um, and so far, I will say, um, out of ten. Yeah. Um, maybe we'll give it a seven so far. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's generous because we haven't actually done anything, but it's a beautiful place. It is. It's done. Um, Morning guys! Morning guys! Hello, so, oh where's Julianne? Hello, hello, there hello. you are. So it is day six or five in Tulum, I don't know. But <laughs> we are on our way to the Mayan runes right now. We're doing a whole group of things today. We're doing the runes, we're doing the ATVs, we're forcefully doing the cenotes and zip lines. I ain't no. doing no zip line. Zip line. Uh -huh. And then we're doing a Mayan sacrifice. And Julianne has kindly volunteered. So <laughs> can't wait for that. Yay! We'll I take you along. Nico's girls. Nico's girls. Dora, 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 the explorer. <laughs> Wait, what is it? Swiper, no swiper. Swiper. <laughs> hey guys, on the way back, take a photo. What is going on? Is that a monkey? <laughs> <laughs> Are you gonna explain, Nico? Yeah. Yeah. Right of the ruins. Ah, oh, fair enough. Here, la clase alta vivió aquí la gente rica. The old people of the high class live here, mis amigos. They consider right the important people. When the Mayan people they construction the houses, they construction with the small door. Con puertas muy pequeñas las construyeron. When you go for take a photo, can you see the, the flat stone inside of the room? Pueden ver unas piedras planas dentro. <laughs> Guys, so we made it into the Mayan ruins. Yeah. We're here and it's very pretty actually. It's very interesting it really to see the culture yeah. and the history. You know, big up the Mayans, they were one of the first indigenous people. Big up them. Big up them, do you know what I mean? They slept on stone. Shout out to them. Shout out and to them. And carried the stone on their heads. Can you imagine? They made them flat yeah. And they used to sacrifice all the time. Honestly. Every 28 days. Imagine, could you sacrifice something that you love? Well, out of all of you guys here, who would be the first to go? I think Julianne, and I then think Sonia. Sonia. That's neighbor group. And then Esther. Oh yeah, true. <laughs> true, true, true. That would hold. That would hold the most weight. Yeah. Yeah. Well, fair enough. Nothing.
This is going to be the real us. Authentic. Get in. So we're just on top of the Mayan ruins. Do you know what? I, I love my hands. Look here. Strike here. It's a video. Yeah, it's a video. Oh. Oh. Come on. <laughs> a video. Importante. <laughs> Hey. Yeah, fine. Okay. Me and horses from Fiji. Never again. Hi. Pinch a little bit, guys. And come on inside and throw it right there. See, Bashka Walik is como esta. Hey guys, so just got back from dinner with the girls. So we went to Rosa Negra and I'm not gonna lie, I had such high expectations and it really like my expectations were just shot on. Like I'm not saying don't go, but it's a very specific type of people that go there. Like if you want a restaurant slash club that you can't hear your dinner companions, there's no lighting, there's no peace, it's just loud, loud music, sparklers every two seconds, you'll love Rosa Negra. But if you want a normal dining experience where you can talk to the people across from you, you can see what you're eating. I had to put, fucking put a flashlight on my food, like I couldn't see shit. And I have the biggest headache now. I'm not complaining about it, but I just don't think it's for me. And, which is very funny because I love a good club. I love a big booming club, bounce, bounce, bounce. But Rosa Negra, Rosa Negra was a bit too much. Not gonna lie, a bit too much. Would you guys agree? Yeah. yeah. Did you guys? And anyone here love Rosa Negra? Hello, birthday girl. Mm -hmm. To be honest, how did you get a birthday cake? Let's really get back into this. Let's get into Esther. Esther, did you actually? I mean, have you seen her outfit? She very much looks like a birthday girl, so I said it is her birthday. And that's really selfless because Esther, hashtag Ashley, she's been the birthday girl this whole trip. <laughs> so Esther doing that is just shows the type of love she has for Sonia. Oh, how cute. Look at Garacha, look at Garacha. Hey, look at our fountain chips from Mexico. Ewo. Ewo. Fountain chips in Mexico. Don't play. Don't play. Don't play. Esther's here ordering another cocktail as usual. Her. That's her seventh one today. <laughs> Sonia's here. Oh, this is the jungle gym, guys, by the way. Sonia's here watching her story for the 85th time, as she does her. Watch this. I need a shot. <laughs> and we're at the beach. Live it all on. <laughs> Julianne's on the phone. Esther. Um, they can't really afford to stay in Mexico any longer. I've just realized that oh. like, I'm 13 percent Mayan. What? I'm from where? Where did you hear that one from? Um, <laughs> Heritage.com. Where did you do Heritage? You have to send them like your hair and stuff. I know. What? What did you send them? I send them my story. <laughs> <laughs> I send them my story and they looked at me and they're like, yep. Really? Mayan. Wow. 13%. No way. Mad. 
not even messy. Anyway, they're still going home. I'm staying though. So anyway, I'm you decided to give me a passport because I'm your thirteen percent Maya. Yeah. Really? Yeah. I don't think so, babe. If anything, you look at the Colombian. Now I <laughs> they're going home, but I'm staying. I'm staying because I decided. Oh, I forgot. Forgot. I love Mexico, and I'm never leaving, guys. So that's basically the gist of the story. If you want to watch my YouTube vlogs now, just know I'm going to be in Mexico. So I just want everyone to know my change of location. Mexico. So you guys can understand. Mexico. You understand? You don't understand? That's not my problem. Per. Sexy. Alrighty. <laughs> the seven wonders of the world. And we don't want your feet in there, Missy. Oh, sorry, though. <laughs> uh, here, at least Madre wants my feet in them. His name was Miguel. You were. Oh, Miguel. <laughs> she said Madre. Madre oh. means mother in Spanish. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, stop. Those guys. No, this she is not stays, my story. She stays on this her is, phone this is and she watches her story. I'm not even, like, this is. I'm not even messing. I haven't watched real. my story since the last Right, okay, come on, watch your story again. You know you no, want to. No, that wasn't my story. That was someone reposting my post. <laughs> I'm serious. I'm serious. Okay. Anyway, guys, this is Sonia. Hi, We're both a robo. If you don't know, now you know. Now you know. Um, she's a robo, yeah, but Esther is also a Yoruba. So I'm half Yoruba, half Yoruba, as everyone knows clearly. So that's it. So guys, it's our last night in Tulum. Um, we decided to have a nice, quiet dinner um, by the beach, and just to celebrate. You know, it's very nostalgic. We're gonna miss each other a lot, but it's been a very good holiday. What are you gonna say, sis? We'll see you soon. It's such a romantic year. Yeah. I'll show, I'll show them. <laughs> I'm going to miss you guys. What are you going to say? I'm going to see you guys in like two days. <laughs> <laughs> what about you guys? It was an amazing journey. It's been a good journey. <laughs> it's been a good trip. Yeah. yeah. It's been a successful trip. successful trip. We're definitely from Bath. Yeah. But next is Punta Cana. So you just you just catch us up on the cars. Oh wow. The camera makes this look so beautiful. I love this camera. This is automatically it does night mode. Look at that. This is our view. We're in Casa Maria having some appetizers, some nachos. Some nachos. Yeah, no, I've really, really had a good time, and it's, I feel like it's been a good transition. Like, if I had flown it's just, weeks <laughs> it did, it actually did. If I had flown directly from Australia straight to Ireland, I would have struggled because I would have to like flip my time clock all over again. But I feel like it's good that I came here, so I can like I'm already adjusted now to the time zone, so it'll be easy for me when I go back to Ireland. So, good, 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 good decision. But see you guys in Ireland. That will be our next vlog. Well, Iceland or Ireland. But yeah. Bye guys. Les enfocado, les enfocado. Pero cariño entiendo.